Hello and welcome to N54 News. We begin with distressing reports from the Badlands. A Militech humanitarian convoy was attacked by a ruthless band of nomad outlaws. Corporate security forces responded with force only as a last resort after their escape route had been cut off. Although several Militech vehicles suffered damage, the nomads have failed to open them. Time. Hey! Come on. Time to lay it out for those little idiots. Their 15 minutes is up. Hey, wild idea I got. How about we forget the whole thing and just enjoy the show? Please stop. Won't be no show. And you're gonna help me make sure of that. How might we do that? Simple. We get in the club, find the little slut's dressing room, do our thing, Delta. So, step one. Any idea how to get in? Let's look around. V! Heard they're huge in Mumbai and Tokyo. Know how much their Golden Circle tickets went for? More than our last bonus, Chum. No fucking way. And that deal with Kiroshi? You know our guys tried talking to him. Heard a hundred million practically pop their off his chrome. Still got on the manager's list, got passes. We'll see what the million Eddie fuss is about. Fuck yeah. <laughs> lucky, lucky me. Stage. Passes. Chill, we'll get our passes. Be right back.
try that new one? Not yet. Yeah. Club gigs. Amateur hour. If they were any good, maybe fill in stadiums. Need a pass to the dressing rooms. Guy there? Rody. So, he's done with his job for now. He's gonna want a drink, get himself some strange. Uh-huh. So he won't be needing that card. Distract him. I'll grab the pass. And Blue Moon told me at rehearsal they haven't had this quality sound in a long time. No artifacts, Find him? no reverb. So I says to her, I know where you can thank me after. In you go. And what Blue Moon say? Told me to do my fucking job and set up the deck. But you know, with all that makeup on, hard to say what they're really thinking. How the fuck am I supposed to know what goes where? That's it. Fuck it. I'm going back to installing feed cables. I'm probably gonna send Ronnie over to Europe. He tell him you were pregnant? Sure, but he can't opt out. We're still paying off his implants. Oh, it's not that bad. They locked mine up when Diego was barely one. Look how he turned out without a father. <laughs> Hun, not judging, but Diego's man in corners. I don't know what you're talking about. 